Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about how to work out a polygon's angles. Now, before you do that, the one thing you want to consider is how many degrees this polygon has, and there's actually a formula associated with that, and it's of the form n minus 2 in parentheses times 180 uh, degrees. So n is the number of sides a polygon has. So basically, if, for example, if you want to find out in terms of this quadrilateral, how many degrees it has, since that's four sides, you just plug in four, so it'd be four minus two times 180 degrees, and that's going to be two times 180, which is going to be 360 degrees. So the idea here is, depending on how many angles that you have already have filled in, it's always good to know what the total number is going to be. So for example, if you have, if this was 50, if this was 100, and if this was, 120 degrees, and then you want to find out what x happens to be. All you need to do is add all these angles and set it equal to 360. So the idea here is 100 plus 120 is 220, plus 50 is 270, and then just do the basic algebra. You're going to have x is going to give you 90 degrees. Now obviously it doesn't look like 90 degrees, but again it's just kind of rough sketch and just an illustration for you. But the bottom line is you definitely want to use this formula to kind of help you figure out what the total number is going to be and then depending on how many angles that you have, plug in all the pieces and then you'll get to find the missing one. So I'm Jimmy Chang and that's how to work out a polygon's angles.